Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be doing my August favorites for you guys. I cannot believe it's already September. So weird, but fall is my all-time favorite season, so I am really, really excited for the fall to get here. I have a lot of favorites to share with you guys for this month, so enough talking, let's jump right in. This flower crown is not attached to my head whatsoever. It's literally just sitting on top of my head because I ended up getting it tangled in my hair and having to rip some pieces out earlier. Not going to mess with the tie anymore and just jump right into the favorites. The first things I want to talk about in my August favorites are hair related and the first one is a hair tool. This is the Bedhead Diffuser. This is specifically designed for curly girls and curly hair. I dried my hair with it today and I just love it. This is just so handy and neat. I don't have to search for that diffuser attachment all throughout my house. This is just so nice that it's just built in. I love, love, love this. This is super handy and I use this every time I do my hair now. I am obsessed. The next hair product I want to mention is a line and is the Shea Moisture African Black Soap Dandruff Control Shampoo and the Dandruff Control Hair Mask. Now I got this one on sale. My scalp had been crazy, crazy, crazy itchy. I don't know what was happening, but my hair was on fire for probably a month straight. It was so uncomfortable, I hated it, and I tried everything. And between apple cider vinegar rinses and these products right here, I don't have itchy scalp anymore, which is so nice because that was a very, very hard time. It was almost like I had eczema in my scalp, which I'm sure is a possibility because I have eczema on my face. But my scalp was the itchiest it's ever been. Like, I, it was just terrible. I don't have dry scalp anymore. It was a lifesaver. So I'm so, so thankful for these products. That's why they are my favorites of this month. Now on to makeup. The next product I want to mention is a foundation, and this is the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Foundation in the shade Cream Cafe. I have it on my face today, and I love this foundation. At first when I purchased this, I purchased this a while ago, but I kind of forgot about it, and then I rediscovered it this month, and I love the application of this foundation, for a drugstore, I think it's like $10.99 or something crazy like that. It's a tad expensive for a drugstore. I'm not even going to lie to you, but this does give very, very good coverage. If you're looking for a high-end drugstore <laughs> makeup, then definitely check out this L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte. They do have coupons, guys, so check the Sunday paper because if this is out of your price range, clip those coupons. You can always find coupons for L'Oreal products everywhere. So I love this. The next two makeup products I want to mention are concealers. And as you guys may know, if you've been following me for a really long time, I love the MAC Pro Longwear Concealers. I had been wearing that concealer religiously pretty much my whole life. And I was like, you know what? I'm never gonna find another concealer that works as well as that. I was like, you know what? I need to branch out. I need to get out of my comfort zone. I need to try something different. And I had always wanted to try the Tarte brand and I decided to pick up the Tarte Shape Tape. Now this stuff, this is the stuff guys. It does a very good job of concealing my under eye creases, which I was really, really impressed with. I will put some underneath my eyes, blend it out, and then go back in and I will place it directly in the crease. I will wait for it to dry while I do my brows and then I will blend it out and it just gives the most flawless coverage. I love this concealer. I'm very, very impressed with this and I've been using it every day. The next concealer I want to mention is the Too Faced Born This Way Concealer. This concealer is a lot lighter than the Tarte Shape Tape, like a lot lighter. When I am getting ready to go to work in the morning and I roll out of bed, brush my teeth, and don't put any makeup on, I get in my car and at each stoplight I apply a different product. We all know the struggle getting up in the morning and I will put this on underneath my eyes and it lasts all day. I don't set it, I just put it underneath my eyes. It is my exact skin color. It lasts all day. I really like it. It's a perfect go-to just 
throw on concealer and I am in the shade tan in the shape tape too so I'm in tan in both of these colors the next few products I want to talk about are from makeup geek and I don't know why I was so late to the makeup geek train but I was definitely missing out these are all makeup geeks everything from <laughs> so everything over here are Mac shadows like my favorite Mac shadows so this is kind of like my everyday go-to makeup palette and here are all of the Makeup Geek shadows, and I just love them. Like, look at the pigmentation of that. And they are so creamy and buttery, and they blend out so, so, so nicely. I would almost say they're a little more pigmented and a little bit easier to blend than MAC eyeshadows, and I love MAC eyeshadows, so me saying that really, really is saying something. I was really, really impressed with these. And then these blushes, though. I love these blushes and I picked out summer fling this one is covet and then chivalry these are my three favorites so far I'll mix them all together I'll mix these two together I'll wear this one by itself I just love the application they're on my cheeks right now they just give me the most beautiful flush they actually show up on my skin without me having to like really dig my brush in there and like throw it on my cheeks i love these they are so pigmented and beautiful the next product i want to mention is a foundation and this is a high-end foundation so i had my drugstore favorite and now this is my high-end favorite and it would have to be the Urban Decay All Nighter Foundation, and this is in the shade 8.75. This is like the all nighter setting spray. This is not going anywhere. This is going to stay on your face all night long. I don't get a lot of creasing with this. My foundation looks flawless all day. Like, I just love the look of this foundation. It just, I look like my skin looks perfect like I look airbrushed in real life and I love that now on to skincare the next things I want to talk about are skincare related and these are products that I have been using every day religiously and they are the Kate Somerville this is the Kate Somerville eradicate acne treatment and this is the Kate Somerville eradicate mask I love these two I love these so much this is a foaming mask so fun <laughs> this is a foaming mask it is so fun oh my gosh why do I keep dropping it I usually wear this at night before I go to bed I'll put this on my face after I have cleansed my face this just makes me feel like my pores are getting a really deep clean and I love that I love 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 this mask I highly recommend it I have honestly been using it every day and if you guys have been following me on snapchat you guys will know that I love this stuff and you guys will have seen me wear this a bunch of times the next product I want to talk about is the Kate Somerville eradicate acne treatment you let this sit you take a q-tip you dip it all the way down to the bottom you take it out apply it to your pimples you let it sit overnight you wash it off it works like a charm it is just a doctor pimple popper in a jar <laughs> and i love this stuff it is 10 percent sulfur which is something different i don't usually see that in a lot of acne products and i really like that it's a spot treatment so i don't have to place the acne cream all over my face i can just target the areas i want to dry up and it just pops them i love this stuff the next thing i want to mention is the kate somerville mega c dural radiance serum now i haven't used a serum on my face in forever like it's been forever and i tried this serum out recently and i really liked it and it goes along with the kate somerville brand i love the brand so far i was sent four products and three out of the four are my favorites of this month and only because i haven't tried the kate somerville redisphere micro peel yet you place this all over your face and you leave it on overnight and it's supposed to help resurface your skin is just a retinol glycolic treatment so I'm really really excited to try this I haven't had a chance to try it yet but I'm definitely going to try this out soon and let you guys know how it worked but so far I'm really impressed with the Kate Somerville brand I love their stuff the next product I want to mention is a fragrance and I usually don't mention fragrances on my channel but I really really liked this fragrance I was like you know what I need to try a new fragrance it is time 
to find a new fragrance. So I was lucky enough to be sent the My Burberry Black fragrance. This is a sample size and I'm really glad that I received the sample size because if I hated it, I would feel really bad for wasting the product. But lucky for me, I loved this. This is just my perfect go-to scent. It has some musk in it, but it has some vanilla and it's just like it's just like the perfect fall scent. And that is it for my favorites this month. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, as always, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for new videos every week. Make sure to leave comments down in the comment section if you guys have any questions on anything I mentioned in this video or if you have any requests for future videos. Thank you guys so much. I love you guys so, so much. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.